to talk about creating resistance to create velocity. All right, so in order to create velocity, you have to create resistance in a throw. All right, the standard L position, all right, does not create resistance in a throw. It just doesn't happen. Okay, so we need a new way of thinking. We need a new way to teach how to create resistance. All right, so we're gonna use water bottle. Fill it up about a third of the way with water. Okay, this will be the bottom and this will be the top. Okay, so in a standard L position, step and throw, all right, <coughs> the water, all right, is at the top, as we explained before. So it's at the top, all right? When you step and throw, all right, it stays at the top. L position, the water is at the top, you rotate, and you push the ball. There is no resistance in the throw. With high level throwing mechanics and throwing patterns, <coughs> using the water bottle, the water will shift from the bottom to the top, back to the bottom, having that feeling of resistance, okay? So, water will start at the bottom, Okay. It'll shift to the top and back to the bottom before moving forward to ball release. Okay? So we'll start at the bottom, all right? It'll shift to the top and back to the bottom while the hips are moving forward. Trunk is turning back. Okay? Bottom top, bottom, release. 